Hello friends, my name is Avinas and welcome to my channel. Today I have come up with this video specially for the Samsung S8 and S8 Plus users. If you have not received an official software update of 526 MB along with the latest security patch of November 2017, then you must watch this video. In this video, I will tell you how to download this official software update and what are the new things you will be getting. So, let's start. First of all, I will show you my current software status, uh, which is go in the setting about the phone software information. Here at the bottom, you can see that my current security patch is of October 2017. Okay, so this is my current software status. Now, to download this uh, update, what you have to do, you have to actually, if uh, right now, if you go in your uh, software update and if you check, then you will not find any update. It will say that your system is totally updated. But uh, to download this particular update, First, you go to the Play Store and download an app which is Opera VPN. I have already uh, downloaded this app. After downloading, you just open the app and uh, <clears throat> it will start connecting. When it will start connecting, that time you have to select a, this option will come in front of you. That time you have to select a region that is Netherlands in the options. After selecting the uh, region, it will say that you are connected to the uh, Netherlands. Now, just now press the home button and go back again in the setting menu. From there, you go to the software update, download updates man manually. This time when you go there, it will show you uh, that latest software update is available. And uh, as it is of 526 MB, make sure you are connected with the Wi-Fi and automatic download will be started. Once the download uh, will be finished, you will get this page in which it says that what are the new. Here it clearly mentioned that after applying this software update, you will get a security patch of uh, November 2017. What else? It says that uh, Bluetooth stability has been improved. It also says that the device stability has been improved and some bugs has been fixed. It also says that the new and enhanced features have been added. That's obviously we will check out whether some new features have been added or not. So now let's uh, uh, do it. We I have already downloaded it uh, from before so that it will not take much time. Now uh, here it gives you also the options of the installing overnight or now or later so to show you now let's click on the install now button though it says uh, there is a caution button here it says that uh, though uh, there is no any risk of installing this software but better you take a backup of the data though i have not taken the data i am installing it right now let's click on the install now it has started installing it says just to please wait now let's wait uh, i will come back once it is has installed completely you can see it has initiated the system update now it has started let's complete it still you can see it is uh, installing the system updates now see about now friends about my this device i have bought this a uh, few days before only it is uh, not more than uh, 10 days old before that uh, i was uh, using my one plus 3t as my primary device soon i will be coming up uh, as i have updated my one plus 3t uh, on android 8 version so soon i will be coming with a comparison between one plus 3t and uh, samsung s8 you can see it has updated at Android version 8 yes it has updated on the Android version 8 so as we all know this is a 6 GB RAM device uh, and uh, as far as S8 Plus is concerned it is my 4 GB version so obviously I will come up 
with a uh, uh, speed test comparison only that is the field where i can compare this uh, my 3t device uh, with a set otherwise uh, in other any other specs it is uh, not close to the 38 i mean that tt is far far behind compared to s8 so now my this update has installed now they are upgrading the softwares now still let's it uh, it is optimizing my 118 apps so let it finish now when you can see my installation process has finished now it is upgrading my android so let's finish this part also then i will come back so all the background process and uh, downloads installation has been completed now let's see the device status so go into the se setting menu and uh, check in the about phone and software information here you go see and here you can see clearly now my Android security patch is of November 2017 so here my software has updated as I said you and now also check the software update menu also check here now it is checking for the update and let's see what it says okay it says that the latest updates has already been installed so my system is totally updated now so hopefully friend if you were facing any uh, trouble regarding the bluetooth stability or uh, any bug or uh, any issue regarding with your device stability so those issues will be solved in this update and uh, as it says that any new or enhanced features if if it has been added so i will go through uh, in depth uh, with the device for the next three and four days and if i find any uh, new features then i will come up with uh, another video till then bye bye and have a nice day thank you for watching my video